I'm Sam from Sheridan Computers. Uh, in this video, I'm going to go through how to install um, Docker CE on CentOS 8. Um, the only thing you need to um, complete this is a working instance of CentOS 8 and uh, a user with sudo privileges. Um, so let's flip over and get started. Okay, so let's add in the repository. So sudo dnf config hyphen manager let's add repo equals https uh, download dot docker.com forward slash linux forward slash centos forward slash docker hyphen ce dot repo so now we have the uh, docker repository um, set up we need to find the version to install we want the latest version so I'm going to go dnf list docker hyphen ce minus minus show duplicates We'll sort the output. So now we can see the um, Docker versions. Uh, and the latest one here is this one here. So I'm going to install that version of it. Um, so sudo dnf install docker ce hyphen and the version that we picked from above. Um, okay, so it's complaining that we need to install containerd.io. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. Um, I'll just copy the link to the URL. So sudo dnf. Uh, install let's go ahead and install container yep that's fine okay so now because we've installed container just like that we should be able to do sudo dnf install docker ce so yes let's go ahead and do that You'll notice because we installed the uh, container D.io first, um, I didn't have to bother specifying the latest version of Docker. It picked it up. That's one of the um, benefits of doing that. Um, now for this instance, I'm also going to want to install Docker Compose. So in order to do this, um, we're going to need to make sure you've got curl installed which we have. I'm just going to interrupt this while I answer this phone call. Okay, so we need to download the latest version of um, Docker Compose. Use sudo. Okay, I'm going to move that from in fact, not just leave where it is, but uh, need to make it executable. And we now have Docker Compose installed. So now we've got that installed, uh, we're going to need to disable um, Firewall D on this to allow DNS resolution from Docker containers. Um, so I'll do sudo this time because I keep forgetting to do that. System CTL disable Firewall D. 
So that's, that's that disabled, so now we can go ahead and enable Docker. So sudo system ctl enable now Docker. So now we've got Docker enabled on startup. Um, one thing we're going to need to do is add the um, user that wants to use to the Docker group. So sudo user mod minus a g docker uh, showed them. So that's it. Um, you now have um, Docker CE running and ready to go on CentOS 8. Uh, this was a brief video installing Docker, um, just because it's, I need to do it for something, so I just figured, once again, I might as well record it, just in case anybody else needs to know how to do it. So I'll leave a link in the um, description below to our forums, where you can get um, the full output of the commands that you need to do this, it's very quick to do. Um, if you did find this video useful, um, please click the uh, like button, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Um, if you'd like to hire us, head over to our website at sheridan.co.uk, fill out the contact form, and we'll get back to you.